Okay, this is an overview of three products offered by EMA Tactical. You can see them right here. And these products cater to the folks out there that like to hold their ARs with their support hands like so around the magazine well. First variation is a rail mounted, has a pressure switch on each side, finger grooved and textured, and it has a battery compartment on the bottom. This is for obviously the guys out there that like to run tactical lights. And I'll give you a good representation here, what it looks like when it's installed, about like so. And I don't have them installed just for the sake of keeping the video short and to the point. I don't want to run too long here. In any case, continuing on, this is a, another rail mounted option. Very simplistic. Has a texture here, very smooth front strap on this grip. You can see that's about how it will look mounted right about there. Very simplistic approach. This is a third option. Finger groove textured front strap. This doesn't mount on the rail. This mounts around the magazine well like so. All you do is you take three screws out. This comes apart. Put it back together around the magazine wells and tighten it in place. Now my observations, these are all good alternatives to using a standard forward grip. In fact, these items can be used as a forward grip if you so desire. So these don't have to be all the way back on the rail. You can move them forward, still use them as a forward grip. Uh, it's up to the discretion of the shooter. Now this item, I really like this item, but I have noticed one small flaw, and that is just with my personal experience, I can't speak to any other brands of ARs, but with my Bushmaster, again, this is just a simple entry-level Bushmaster, model XM15 E2S, and I'm using polymer magazines. I don't own any aluminum magazines anymore. They're all polymer magazines from EMA Tactical, uh, Command Arms Accessories, and the P-Mags from Magpul. Now, when I have this on, my AR, I've noticed my magazines will not drop free at all. Uh, they're not overly tight in the mag well, but I do have to physically wrap my hands around and pull them out when I need to change mags. So to me, I personally like it when mags drop free, and this may fit a little different on other ARs or work differently with different magazines. Again, I don't have any of the standard aluminum mags, uh, so I can't speak to those. And this may work a lot better with the aluminum mags. Uh, that's just my personal experience so far with these. So I recommend any of these uh, for guys out there looking for something other than a standard uh, forward grip. So again, these are offered from EMA Tactical. And at the end of this video here, I'll put up some information, EMA Tactical's website and their contact number. So if you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Thank you.